everyone welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel if you are new here my name is kate if you are not new welcome back to another vlog i feel like i never start my vlogs this late it's 7 15 right now i just took a bath i've had like the most stressful past couple of days so i figured that i would treat myself and take a bath i watched a little bit of gilmore girls it's like my new favorite show i've been watching it for the past few days i started it on sunday i think and i don't know why i haven't watched it sooner because i'm like really into it but yeah i just took a bath i've just been literally working non-stop staring at my phone staring at my computer and like my eyes hurt like i have like a headache in my eyes if that makes sense like if you know that feeling i'm talking about but yeah i was supposed to see my friend Christina today, she's been on the vlogs before. If you've been watching my channel, then you probably know who she is. She's one of my really good friends. And it just like didn't work out. I had a doctor's appointment that I needed to go to and I just had so much to do. Like these past couple of days have just been crazy and I'm leaving on Sunday to go to Arizona. So this vlog is gonna be like prep and pack with me and get ready for my trip we're only going for four days and we have two full days there it's like such a quick trip because zach couldn't really get that much time off of work and we just figured we would go for something to do i guess and then the sunday we get back or no we get back on a friday at 12 in the morning and that day we leave to drive up to New York for Revolve Gallery. It's gonna be hectic, so stay tuned for that vlog. That vlog is probably gonna be up after this one, but yeah. So I am going to do my skincare right now, and I've been loving this Tatcha cleansing oil to remove my makeup, and normally I'm not one to like cleansing oils, but for some reason I just really like this and I don't have to like tug at my skin with my micellar water because usually I use like the Garnier micellar water but I just love how like it just like melts your makeup off. I'm like really into it. I'm gonna use this and like massage it into my skin and make sure everything is off i only wore like a little bit of concealer and some powder so while that's like still sitting on my face i'm then going to wash my face with the pure castle soap this is the face wash that i use so i'm also going to go in with my micellar water i feel like a psycho but i just really like to make sure all the makeup and like the sunscreen my skincare from this morning is off of my face. I have like a fear of that because I never used to wash my face when I first started wearing makeup when I was like 13 years old and I would go to bed with it on. And then I watched a video when I was 13 or like around that age on YouTube and it was this girl saying that she always washes her face and does her skincare before bed no matter how tired she is. She always takes her makeup off. And ever since I watched that video, I have never gone to bed with my makeup on. So I'm kind of proud of myself for that. So I just like to make sure everything is off and a nice and fresh face. So I'm just going to add my pharmacy retinol. And then I usually moisturize with my Rode barrier cream but this is like literally gone and i can't use it anymore i ordered another one the other day because it came out again but i like can't get any more out of that bottle so i'm going to use my tatcha silk cream this is like one of the best moisturizers i have literally ever put on my face it just feels so nice and i don't know how to explain it like it's so soft when you're like rubbing it on your face I feel like it's like a very good cream for the nighttime. Like it just feels like it's locking in all the hydration. And then for my eye cream, I use this Cheer Up by Pharmacy. And I really like this eye cream. I feel like it's like my favorite eye cream I've ever used. Some eye creams like sting my eyes and like make my skin burn. 
but I just love like the consistency of this one and I really do feel like it brightens my under eye and then I'm gonna apply my grande lash serum this stuff is like my new holy grail I never miss a night putting this on it's really good it's really worth the hype if you're thinking about getting it so highly recommend that and then also my new favorite deodorant which i always put on deodorant like if i take a night shower or a bath i always put deodorant on after like do any of you do that um i don't know i just like to be clean but this has been like my new go-to deodorant it's the necessaire deodorant gel and it smells like eucalyptus I don't know what it is, but my mom just switched over to like a roll-on deodorant and she swears by it. And I actually gave this to my mom, but took it back because I ran out of my deodorant that I was using. And I feel like the gels and like the roll-on ones just work so much better. Like I don't have to reapply this throughout the day. I don't smell, like I don't feel sticky. So I don't know, like maybe it's like a deodorant roll-on thing, but I think it's like so good and it smells good it's not like a harsh smell or whatever this is really good if you're looking for a good deodorant i just changed my shirt because i literally just got tomato sauce on my other shirt and i threw it in the wash so don't mind that but i just put on this billy sorbet super solve they sent me a few things and like i just put this on for the first time and it's so moisturizing it kind of has like a pink tint to it but that's all my skincare for right now that's all i'm gonna do i'm probably gonna watch some more gilmore girls and relax a little bit and i will see you in the morning vlog it's friday morning i also forgot to mention it's september now mm -hmm. so we're in the starbucks drive through i got my first pumpkin chai of the season like two days ago mm -hmm. have you ever tried pumpkin cold foam i think like once you should i should again i'll have some of yours although everyone on tiktok is saying that it's not that good this year and i kind of feel that way too it's like not as thick as it usually I mean, it sounds like yeah it blows this year huh because everyone's it's... saying it's not the same i don't know what how, what we'll side of today. tiktok how you have to be on to hear about pumpkin cold foam exactly because i'm obsessed with fall is, is that fall tiktok yeah i always see tiktoks my tiktok for you page is like starbucks fall candles candles wellness it's like literally me. What are you getting? Hi, I'm good. How are you? Getting yourself. Good. <laughs> what can I get you today? Could I please get a tall ice chai with almond milk and pumpkin cold foam? So you want a tall ice chai tea? Yes, please. I want venti decaf. Quick question. Do you still want the glasses pictures on the coffee? No, thank you. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Have a good Hi. Good. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. I'm going to have to keep the window closed because there's like a wash. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I thought he was like just trying to keep it close to his or something. I was wondering why he kept shutting the window. Do you like any straws and napkins? No, that's okay. Thank you. Thank you. You too. It's literally so beautiful. I can't get over it. And to get back on the pumpkin cold foam thing, I don't know. I feel like it's better today than when I got it the other day and i feel like it isn't as thick as like the regular cold foam that i usually get but it's still yummy like i can't complain it's my favorite thing ever so if you want to try it out i get a tall ice chai almond milk and pumpkin cold foam this will probably be my drink for the rest of the fall so i'm back home now it's 2 37 i started to take out some clothes and 
just trying to get things organized because I'm going to start packing and I'm also going to try on some outfits and share them with you to show you what I will be wearing. I also brought my mirror that's in our living room in the bedroom and I kind of really want to leave it here but I really like having a mirror in the living room too because I feel like it just opens the space and makes it look bigger so I think I'm gonna get the big mirror that's from Ikea that's like this but like doesn't have a frame this one is from Urban Outfitters by the way if you're interested I will link it down below it's so cute and I love it but anyways I figured that I would show you my outfits in here since it's just easier because I have like all my clothes out here but this is gonna be my airport outfit it's all from Aritzia. This top is Aritzia. My pants are Aritzia. And these are the Derby track pants, I believe they're called. They're so cute. And I wore these to the airport the last time I went to the airport. They're just like so comfy, but I know that I'm going to be sweating when we get there since it's going to be like over 100 degrees in Arizona when we're there. But the airport's like usually cold and like, I don't know what the vibe is going to be. So... This is gonna be my airport fit and then my sneakers are the New Balance 530s. So this is gonna be the airport fit. Oh, and I'm also gonna show you my outfits for New York as well since I'm not gonna have time to obviously do that when I'm leaving. So this is gonna be like my outfits for Arizona and New York. So this outfit I'm gonna bring for like a hike or something or just walking around and I know what you're thinking. It's gonna be 108 degrees. Why on earth do you have like a sweatshirt on your shoulders? But I figured that I would like try. I don't, I don't know if you've seen it, but there's like a trick on TikTok to like wear a crew neck like this. Like, I don't even know how to describe it. This one is like kind of tight to do it like this. I don't know, it's from Ritzia, but my shoulders get so burnt and I don't know if we're gonna go to like the Grand Canyon. Like I have no idea what we're gonna do. So I just wanna like play it safe. So that's why I have this on. I just wanted to like see what it would look like with this outfit, but I'm wearing my Aritzia black divinity romper. It's just like so easy to just throw on and have yourself a little hiking outfit, I guess. And then these new balances are, I actually forget which ones these are, but I'm gonna bring these for like walking and stuff because I don't want to bring those ones because they'll get dirty but just like a little walking outfit I guess so this outfit I was thinking for more of something like if we're not going hiking or like going to dinner breakfast or something just like something a little more cute and girly so this skirt is from Brandy Melville it's so wrinkled right now I have to like do something about that and then this top is from Aritzia. It's super cute. I don't even think I've ever worn it before, but I really like the color. And then I just paired it with these sneakers from Reebok. I don't know. Just something to have as like an option if I don't want to just wear like hiking and like walking around outfits. Just something really cute and light and airy because it is going to be so hot. Actually, never mind. I just found this top that I have from Free People. It's just like a strap cami and it's like a rich mocha brown color so i feel like it would be cute for fall because the blue shirt i was like mm, it's too summery and i'm like in the fall mode and i just like the dark mocha brown color so i'm gonna bring this tank top instead but with the same sneakers and then another like active outfit i guess because i know that it's just gonna be so hot and we're gonna be exploring. This tank is from Aritzia. I'm wearing Aritzia brown biker shorts and then I just tied this flannel that is from Urban Outfitters around my waist just to make sure I don't get a sunburn. And then I'm gonna bring these sneakers. These are my Adidas Swift Runs. Don't mind my socks, by the way. I'm not gonna be wearing these. But I'm gonna bring these instead because they're already like really dirty. Well, not really dirty. You can't really tell on camera, but they're like off colored. So I don't really care if I get these dirty, but this is going to be my last outfit for Arizona. We're only going for literally four days. So I don't need to bring a whole lot. So those are all of my outfits for Arizona. Okay, moving on to 
New York. This is probably what I'm going to wear to the Revolve Gallery. We're going to be there for three days. We're going to be there Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, but we're only going to the actual Revolve Gallery on Saturday. So this is what I'm going to wear to the gallery. This dress is obviously from Revolve. It's by the brand Lacademy. It's like one of my favorite brands that Revolve has. It's a very pretty brown knit dress and I think it's gonna be like 80 degrees when we're there but I don't really care because I love this dress. It's so fall. I love it. And then I'm gonna bring this bag with me which is from Anthropology. It's my Bottega dupe. I will link it down below. It's so cute. And then I'm gonna bring these shoes. They're from Princess Polly. I think they're so cute and I just wanted to match like my bag to my shoes. They're black but it's giving all the fall vibes. I love this outfit and these shoes are so comfortable actually. Like I haven't worn these in such a long time. I forgot how comfortable they are, but I'm just loving this outfit. I think it's really, really cute. So this will probably be what I wear to the actual gallery. I'm so obsessed. So on the days that we're just like hanging out, checking out the city and whatnot, I'm bringing this dress that is from Aritzia. Literally half of my stuff is from Aritzia. This is the Wilfred Free, I forget the name actually, but it's from Wilfred, I'm pretty sure. It's just like a bodycon mini dress and I paired it with my Reebok sneakers, some high socks that are also from Aritzia, and then this black bag that is from Urban Outfitters. Just like a really cute and casual outfit to throw on and walk around the city i'm all about like pieces like this because it looks super cute but it's just a midi dress i've had this dress for years and it's like one of my favorites i love it so this last outfit is just another casual walking around the city type of vibe and these cargo pants are from urban outfitters they're like my favorite pair of pants right now they're so cute major Hailey Bieber vibes and I washed them and stuck them in the dryer and like the pockets are kind of weird so I have to like steam them or something or iron them but those are my pants my top is from Aritzia just like a ribbed gray t-shirt and then I'm wearing the New Balance 530s again and then the same black bag from Urban Outfitters so those are all my outfits and I'm gonna start packing everything, putting everything in my suitcase. Okay, little side note before I start actually packing. I got the Stanley Tumblr. I think it's called the Quencher Tumblr. I actually got this for a partnership that I'm doing with them, which is so exciting because I've always wanted to try this water bottle. Just like every other girly there on TikTok. I was just so excited when they reached out to me and I have to say this is by far the best water bottle I have ever tried and used not even saying that because It's this one like it genuinely is one of my favorite water bottles like it fits in my car I love how it like is slim at the bottom. So it does fit in your car. It has a big Handle you can like change the cap Take out the straw and like close it like it's just such a good water bottle all around and it leaves your drinks like whatever's in there super cold and it's also big bold and fun and i'm just so obsessed with it so i'm just drinking my water and i've been drinking so much more water ever since i got this i like fill it so many times a day because it's just fun to drink out of and then i'm having a little snack these are grain free pretzels that are milk chocolate covered i showed these in a couple vlogs ago this brand saver by suzy sent them to me they are so good and i can't stop eating them I'm obsessed with them and I'm pretty sure I've seen them at Trader Joe's and if they do I'm gonna grab more because they're just that good. They also have dark chocolate, but me and Zach already ate those ones So I'm just having this for a little snack. They're so good
So I just packed some of my skincare and my hair care. I'm just going to leave it in the bathroom because I do need some of this stuff for like tonight and tomorrow. But I just want to have it packed. That way I don't forget it. So I have this little Lululemon pouch thing that I got the last time I traveled. It's really cute. So I just have like my skincare and stuff in here. I have this Glossier bag, which I don't know if I'm going to use because the little zipper thing came off. But I just have some hair products in here, my brush, my comb, and stuff like that. So I just put everything in the suitcase except for like my skincare and stuff and zach is gonna need to put all of his stuff in here because the suitcase is way too big and i have nothing else to put in here yeah so he's probably just gonna put all of his stuff in there too since we have so much room the suitcase is from amazon if i can find it i will try to leave a link down below because it's humongous like it's so big i feel like the camera does not do it justice and it has like a lot of pockets it has a lot in the front too so i will leave a link to it down below i'm like out of breath though from packing and just putting everything in my suitcase picking out outfits so yeah i don't really know what else to do it's friday so i don't really have a lot of work to do right now i pretty much did all of it and i'll probably just watch some gilmore girls to be honest until zach gets home maybe we'll go to dinner or do something breakfast I had pancakes these are like my favorite pancakes to make I posted the recipe on my food account earlier this week so if you haven't seen that recipe definitely go try it I've been making them like so many times they're so good and they're so easy to make so definitely check those out but I just finished them I put some eye patches on I'm gonna watch Gilmore Girls it's literally like my favorite thing right now i just love watching it like i don't even know how to describe it i'm on episode 12. usually i'm not one to binge watch a show alone like me and zach usually watch shows we've been watching this instant home makeover show that's on netflix but i don't know just something about like having my own show to watch is like really nice and like i can just watch it on my own time and I don't know i just love the show and also it just reminds me of me and my mom's relationship so it's just like really fun to watch but happy saturday we leave tomorrow and i just checked us in actually on my phone i also have to set up an uber to pick us up at like three-ish because our flight's at like 5 30. i have like trauma from missing or like being afraid of missing our flight because me and zach have missed i think like three flights and it oh my god they were just like awful like the first time me and zach ever went away together we literally missed our flight on the way back home and then when we went to italy we missed our flight and they were all zach's fault by the way and i remember i was like crying in the airport because i just wanted to go home and like they wouldn't give us another flight for free and like we had to pay six hundred dollars to come back home like it was such a mess and i just always like to make sure that we get there on time we're not gonna miss our flight like so i'm gonna set up the uber because if it's left up to zach 
it's so funny because I like to be on time and be there early like I'm always on schedule and he's like a very last minute type of person and I can't do that like that gives me such anxiety but anyways I'm gonna set up our uber and finish packing the rest of my toiletries and stuff later in the day but I'll probably go and see my mom today and spend time with her before we leave because as you all know I'm like attached at the hip to my mom so I'll probably see her today I also did a little Sephora order I have to pick up concealer and then I also got a lip gloss so I'll do that on the way to my mom's that's it really I'm just chilling on the couch just had some pancakes and watching Good More Girls that's like such a weekend vibe so I'm back home from my mom's it's like five o'clock ish and I picked up a few things for the trip like travel size things I needed to get a little conditioner I was gonna take my regular shampoo but I feel like it's such a waste just to take the full size of everything so I just picked up a few travel size things I got toothpaste some body lotion little bar of soap the essentials you know Clorox wipes for the plane and stuff like that I'm a huge germaphobe and then my mom gave me this little Olaplex shampoo that she had so I'm just gonna take that with me and then my little mini Sephora haul. I just got my concealer that I normally use, the Kosas concealer, and I'm in the shade 1.5C. And then I got the Fenty Beauty Gloss Bomb Lip Gloss in Hot Chocolate. It's like a dark brown color. I just am into like fall colors right now and it's so pretty. It's like a mauve brown and it has some shimmer in it. It's not very pigmented, so. It's just like a little pop of color, I don't know. I thought it was really cute. And then I ordered a pair of Uggs. They came to my mom's house because sometimes I usually get stuff sent there because our package room is like a complete mess. And I got the slipper. I forget what these are called, like Tasman slipper or something. And I figured these were going to sell out because... I feel like this color always sells out and I wanted to get the ultra mini Uggs in this color last year and I never had my size and I just figured these would be so cute for fall. I just like love this detailing. I think they're so cute and that's all but probably not gonna vlog the rest of the night. I'm gonna take a shower, finish putting like the last minute stuff in the suitcase. My electronics, camera, battery, all that stuff. So I will see you in the morning. Yeah.